Well, good morning, you guys, and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna be trying a little bit different of a video. I have never done like a vlog on my channel, a true vlog on my channel before. So, <laughs> and I did not get one of my DIYs recorded for you guys in time to get it edited and uploaded. Still, we're gonna try to do a little bit of a vlog. Um, and plus, daycare was closed today because there's a stomach flu outbreak, which everybody knows what that means. It's coming for us next. <laughs> but while I'm feeling healthy and well, might as well get a little vlog up for you guys and kind of show you what I do on like an off day. Okay, so I wanted to show this <laughs> outfit. Um, I love this like sweater poncho thing. I know my mom got it for me a few years ago, but oh, I just, I'm so like torn when it comes to outfits like this um, when I'm pregnant. I just, they're so comfy, but <laughs> like, I don't know, I tend to wear, I tend to wear like form-fitting things when I'm pregnant because otherwise I feel like it's always like a, t like you're wearing a tent. I, so yeah, can't really like tell that I'm 33 weeks pregnant <laughs> and then I turn to the side and <laughs> it's just like a tent, like a literal tent. I don't know. Tell me what you guys think. Do you like to wear loose things or more form-fitting things when you're pregnant. I tend to wear more form-fitting things, but I don't know. I'll try it today for a little bit. See how it goes. I don't know. Okay, so I think our plan of attack for the day, now that it's like 10.30 and we finally just got um, ready to go for the day, I need coffee and I need coffee so bad. So. Um, and she needs some more panties because potty training. Um, <laughs> she needs some new panties. And mom needs to get some things as well. So I think we're gonna run to Target, grab a few things, and get some coffee, and then come back here and I'm gonna tackle some signs, I think. We'll see. We'll see. It's Christmas, Christmas time. It's Christmas time. Look at the hug. Hello. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm going to touch the boogers. Uh, don't touch your boogers. Oh no, it's this. These are your teeth, huh? Boop. Stop it! <laughs> You're fine. You got your wings. Stop it! I'm having oh, a meltdown because. She couldn't get the wings out of her jacket. This is real mom life, you guys. Okay, let's go. Hey, let's go. I'm leaving. Don't take a picture. <laughs> okay, let's go. Now she wants me to take a picture. That's because this is where I take all my pictures. Yeah, can you peep this porch? Does it look Instagram familiar? Okay, hey. Mommy's boogers are freezing. We should go. Mommy, what? It's cold. <laughs> Dad. Uh, this is real life with a three year old. Everything is the end of the world. It's because her hat's not on the right way. That's why she's crying. Oh. Okay. It's <laughs> a good bed. Kaya, come help me pick one out. That's cute. And so is this one. So is this one. I think I might get this one. Have to kiss everything, don't you? Okay. Here, I'll give it to the lady. Here. It's a lady? Yep, wait our turn though. Hi. Wait your turn. Hi. Want me to hold it for you? Are you hungry? Okay, ice cream. Hey. Ice cream. Well, no ice cream. Hey, would you like to have a muffin? No. <laughs> okay. 
You want to sit in the cart and try a bite? Muffin. It's kind of like a muffin. Here, do you want to come sit over here and we'll eat it? Yeah, let's go try. Ever? That's okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I can get all one thing, not you. <laughs> can I get one? Mm -hmm. <laughs> no. You like that one? That's a pretty good one. Mm, they all, that one's even better though. Okay. Yeah. Hiya, how about this one? Is this one cute? Yeah. What do you think? It's so soft. I put it on. Should I put it on? You want to stay here? You want to stay at Target forever? Yeah. Oh, you guys, how cute is this little jacket? Can you come pick up ornaments for your tree? We'll do some ornaments. A little tree for you. Are you tired? Shopping with toddlers, huh? He's not gonna slip. And it was just a little bit chaotic, just a little bit. She was like zigzagging back and forth across Target like a crazy person. Um, just towards the end though, besides that she was really good and she did listen pretty well. So she got a treat and that her, her treat was Captain Crunch. <laughs> that was her treat she chose. And she also chose a watercolor kit, like a painting watercoloring kit, um, which I thought would be really good for like a creative outlet for her. But I will insert a little bit of that footage after this um, clip to show you guys um, that little kit she got, it was super cute. Um, there is Christmas decorations in this hall and that is for the kids' room. Now I say kids' room because Riker's crib is technically in there, but it just is a crib. There's no mattress in there or anything yet. So I'm gonna be doing a clean and decorate with me for Christmas in the kids' room. That'll be up in a couple of days and you'll be able to see how I put these decorations together. I wanted to do like a little bit cuter, like um, like pastels on this little tree. I really wanted to get a rose gold tinsel tree. It was still $80 and I just did not feel like paying that for the Christmas tree that probably would only last for a year in their room because Next year, I don't know if I would want a rose gold tinsel tree um, for Riker to share with Kaya. All right, so I'm gonna go through what I got here. Um, it's kind of a Mod Podge of randomness, but isn't every Target haul ever. First thing I got was some tinsel, like really pretty tinsel garland. Um, I think I'm gonna put this above Kaya's bed or um, above her dresser. Just really sparkly, really pretty. I got some boxes because I have some heck of gifts that I need to wrap. In fact, a lot of it is sitting on this shelf behind this Christmas tree so that Kaya cannot reach it. Um, the tree that I got for her room, these were all 30% off. So this is like $10 and 30% off. And once I fluff it, it'll, it'll be a lot bigger. But I just love the flocked look. If I could have this for a tree for my like main tree, I would so do it. Um, I absolutely love it. This was $10 and was 30% off. So it was a good deal. For ornaments for the kids' tree, what I decided to do was, um, like I said, kind of like this pastel-y theme. One of the ornaments already broke. 
I think that was my fault. Or maybe it was the lady's fault because she put them in with shampoo and conditioner. But I'm doing these pastel colors. It should be super cute. Sorry about the glare on there. Super cute on their tree. Um, got some twinkling lights to go on the tree as well. I did a warmer color and then like a rose gold. Um, yes, just a moment. And then I got rose gold beads to go on their tree. I just got a couple of pink candy canes to go on there as well. Super cute. And then I got a couple of banners because I wasn't sure which one I wanted to put up, but one of these I'm gonna end up putting above my bed in my master, and the other I'm not quite sure what I'll do with, but um, these I found in the value section for $3, like I showed you guys. Wrapping paper, um, I did like a pinkish color for Kaya's gifts because I figured it would be a little bit more fun if it was like pink and fun, and then I got Some present gift tags. I didn't have any yet for this year. Just stocked up on some basic facial wipes. And I'm not kidding you, you guys, when I told you that I love Mrs. Meyer's peppermint, I love it. So I got two more of these hand soaps because we have a couple bathrooms running low on hand soap. Got two of those. And I also stocked up on more of the peppermint dish soap because I am obsessed. It's a problem, you guys. Kaya, I've never tried the Swab Kids, I've always done the Dove Kids, but Kaya really liked that this had Elsa on there, so I don't know, Swab isn't like the greatest brand, but we'll give it a shot. And then I got this little um, sign, which was in the $3 spot. I'll probably put this in my room because um, well, Mike and I's room, Mike and I's room is the room with the least decorations right now, so I'll probably put it in there. We got some My Little Pony band-aids and some regular ones. And then for breakfast, I've really been like loving bagels and protein shakes, like switching on and off. So I got some everything bagels and jalapeno cream cheese and chive and onion cream cheese. Yum, that sounds so good to me. I got stuff for dinner this evening, which um, this tortellini is super good. It's the fresh tortellini. Um, three cheese tortellini from Target, the Buatoni, um, and then I just do a little bit of Jimmy Dean with it, and four cheese Alfredo. I'll show you today in our vlog what this meal turns out like. All right, well that's what we got at Target. My battery's flashing, so I gotta plug you guys in. But yeah, kind of a super random haul, and I had a 20% off coupon, and with my red card, I saved I think like $67 between cartwheel, my 20% off coupon, and my red card. It was insane. My total went from like $167 to like $100. So that is what we got in our haul at Target for this morning. Had some fun and we were able to have a little date. So, all right, I'm gonna make some lunch and then charge you guys. And then I don't know what I'm gonna do. Okay guys, so I'm making some more signs right here and watching some Erin Williams, my girl. So excited to find out that she's finally pregnant after her miscarriage, so excited. Anyways, sipping on some Starbucks, watching my girl Erin, <laughs> cutting some vinyl for my signs, and then I've got my signs kind of laid out over here. 
Um, we have a failed nap time for Kaya going on. And I need to start cleaning the kitchen. Look at those dishes, you guys. Oh, why am I showing that on the internet? So anyway, lots of things to do. And I also need to clean Kaya's room. So I've got my hands full. Let's see if I can manage to get all of this done and maybe get you to lay down for a little nap nap, huh? You need a rest for sure. Yeah, you do. Um, yes, and she does need to take a nap because mom needs a break. I've gotta get some stuff done. So I'm gonna freaking freak out if this show keeps playing. This crazy little baby bums show. Is anybody else's kids like obsessed with watching it? Okay. All right, the anxiety's real. The Braxton Hicks are happening. <laughs> Mama needs to calm down. Okay, so I made like kind of a spicy um, rosa alfredo. Kaya, you're just fine. Somebody did not take a nap today, so she's super upset. So I added just a little bit of tomato sauce to the four cheese alfredo. Um, I added quite a bit of crushed red pepper. I'm sure my husband will add more. I just didn't want it to be too overpowering for Kaya. Um, a dash of garlic powder into here, and quite a bit of black pepper to make it kind of a peppery Rosa Alfredo, and then a good dash of Nature Seasons. Um, yeah, and now I'm just kind of letting it bo um, bubble and come to a good rolling boil. Really let those seasonings work their way in. And yeah, this is really yummy. It's really similar to the, if you've had the spicy Roma sauce from Johnny Carino's, it's very similar to that. So, yeah. So that's the sauce we've got going on for dinner. Okay guys, so I have my cooked tortellini here and now I am just going to um, put a little bit aside for Kaya just in case she doesn't like the sauce and then I'll add the rest of the sauce to the, the tortellini noodles. Okay. And you can serve this with like fresh Italian bread. Um, that's what I would use, or French, or fresh French bread. The artisan French rolls or French bread from Costco is so good. Um, some fresh Parmesan on top of this would be super yummy too. But I'm gonna plate it up, show you guys what it looks like. Super yummy. Alrighty, well this is the finished product. Super, super yummy, you guys, the sauce is like spicy and peppery and perfect. I'm sorry my TV is like blasting, but I'm gonna go and I'm gonna dig into my dinner. Um, I'm gonna get Mike served up here. He should be home from work um, in like the next half hour or so. Um, I'm gonna finish these signs, we're gonna deliver them, and then get our bearings about us and figure out what our schedule is for Eminem Rustics for the rest of the week. Um, for those of you who don't know, we run a sign and furniture business on the side after our regular jobs. Um, I'll leave our Facebook link down below. We don't have an actual website yet because we are in the midst of trying to get a website organized. It is a lot of work to do that, but it'll be worth it in the end. So anyways, I'll link that down below for you guys so you can kind of see exactly what we make. So anyway, all right, I'm gonna go mow down because I am hungry and I'm sure Kaya is too. Okay. All right guys, this is a real mom life moment. <laughs> Look at that. Parmesan. Parmesan. Look at the pile on her plate. Kaya. I turned around for two seconds and this is what happens.
So I got three signs done. I would have had four done, but I was having some difficulties with this one down here. Um, I got this one done and these two done. There's a lake house and then behind it is a blessed sign. Now I just gotta pop a frame on this one, pack it up, and make a materials list. <laughs> and go deliver this and get materials, so. Uh, just crazy, yep, that's mommy, yep, that's so important to mommy. That has all of my everything in it, my planner. All right, you guys, I think I'm going to end today's video there, um, leave you hanging a little bit, because this evening I still need to edit this vlog, we still need to go deliver this sign and get materials, and then I'm gonna record another decorate and clean with me up in Kaya and Riker's room. And I'm gonna have Mike help me this time and he's gonna be featured in that video because I need help. No, <laughs> All right, you guys, well, thank you so much for tuning in to today's video. If you like these vlog videos on my channel, make sure you give it a big thumbs up so I know that you like them. Please consider subscribing to my channel before you leave and turn on your bell notifications button so that you don't miss out when I upload a video. And I will see you guys tomorrow in Vlogmas Day 7. Okay, bye guys. <laughs>